The Prime Minister made two policy choices yesterday. He reintroduced knights and dames to the Australian Honours List, and his government voted in the House yesterday to cut $211 payments from the children of orphans. Prime Minister, don't these choices reflect the government's cruel and twisted priorities? Well, uh, <clears throat> nice to get a question from the Honourable Bill Shorten, who has on his front bench uh, the Honourable Mr Mark Dreyfus, Queen's Counsel, uh, Madam Speaker. But, Madam Speaker, <coughs> but Madam Speaker, Madam Speaker, this is... There will be this silence is... on my left. There will be silence on my left. <coughs> The Prime Minister has the call. Madam Speaker, this government's priorities are very clear. The member for we want to take the burdens. We want to take the burdens off families that members opposite member for put Kingsford on them. Smith. Why does the government have a plan to bring back knighthoods and dames, but no plan for Australian jobs? Prime Minister, why is the Abbott government's priority a plan to bring back knighthoods? Well, Madam, Madam Speaker, uh, this is the Prime Minister was listen, the leader of the opposition's question was listened to on, in silence by those on my left. You'll listen similarly to the answer. The Prime this Minister the this call. is a government which is capable of doing <coughs> several things at the same time. But, Madam Speaker, our priority is lifting the burdens on Australian families. Yeah, yeah. And last week, we tried to scrap the carbon tax and Labor made the carbon tax stay. Yesterday, we tried to scrap the mining tax and Labor made the mining tax stay. Uh, we are trying to clean up the building and construction industry. Labor is trying to stop that. We are trying to get rid of union rorts, rackets and rip-offs and corruption of the sort that the former member for Dobell was engaged in. Labor is still protecting that kind of wrongdoing. Now, Madam Speaker, these are our priorities. I am proud of the Prime of them, Minister.